KTEC Scraper Hitch Technical Installation Instructions for Case IH Power Units Note, this video assumes that the existing factory hitch has been removed and the valve block is safely suspended in place. Step 1. Locate the this side down decal on the drawbar and face that side towards the ground. Step 2. Read the notice decal on the face of the hanger. Position the hanger according to the directions given. Note, KTEC has different variations of how hanger plates are bolted to the drawbar, either above, below, or in between. Please read this notice decal before assembling. Step 3. Finger tighten the bolts onto the hitch with the nut on top, as shown in the notice decal. Step 4. Using your best judgment, find a solution to lift and support the tractor hitch. Slide the drawbar underneath the tractor and into the tractor pin slot, then insert the tractor pin securely. Step 5. Align the bolt holes in the KTEC hanger plate to the existing bolt holes left behind by the factory hitch plate. Using the factory hitch plate bolts, insert and finger tighten them into the matched holes. While doing so, be sure to check the alignment and fitting of the hanger plate and drawbar. Adjust accordingly. Once correctly fitted, tighten all the bolts connecting the hanger plate to the tractor first, then tighten all the bolts connecting the hanger plate to the drawbar. Note, the supplied shim plates can be added to fill the gap between the KTEC hitch and tractor. Step 6. Lower the valve block onto the KTEC hitch valve block plate. Reuse the valve block bolts to perform this installation. Note, 50 hours after the initial install, check and retorque all the bolts. Then do so again every 250 hours. Hydraulics. KTEX hydraulic hoses are color-coded for convenience. A color-coded zip tie can be found at the tip of each hose. The color represents the hose's function, which can be easily referenced by looking at the bulkhead decal. Automatic Cushion Ride For the automatic cushion ride feature to function, the vent line must be connected to the vent port of the power unit's hydraulic tank. Failure to connect the vent line will void KTEX warranty.